That's right. Lee Vance is no stranger to law enforcement. As you said, he spent three decades with JPD, retiring as the chief just two years ago. Vance says once he becomes sheriff in January, his biggest challenge will be trying to fix the long-plagued Raymond Detention Center. There is a new sheriff in town in Hines County. How does it feel? It feels like I'm very tired right now, but excited. Veteran law enforcement officer at Lee Vance got nearly 80% of the vote in Tuesday's general election. This is the culmination of almost a year of very, very hard work. Vance admits he will face a tough challenge trying to manage the unmanageable Raymond Detention Center. The sheriff-elect says that will be his top priority. I believe we got to tackle the biggest problem first. So that's my philosophy. The detention center is currently under a federal consent decree and under threat of a possible federal takeover after a monitor called it unsafe for jailers and inmates. The facility has been played with understaffing and inmate fights for years. One detainee died after he was attacked last year. I'm not interested in putting any band-aids on it. I'm interested in coming up with a fix that we can expect long-term progress. Now, Vance will have to work with the Hines County Board of Supervisors. They actually control the purse strings for how much money is spent on the detention center. For the last few years, county leaders have been talking about building a new detention center. The hefty price tag could run into the tens of millions of dollars. Live in Jackson, Ross Adams, 16 WAPT News.